Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Helpful Witch Plays Hogwarts Legacy. Today we have just finished speaking with Sebastian and learning about a cadaver. But you can see in the distance a new quest arises because for kind of Halloween as, you know, it's not really Halloween right now, but it will be soon, I thought we could do a very interesting quest. And that quest is, you might know, you might have guessed given the title, uh, but um, we are going to actually do the Minding Your Own Business quest. Um, and if you don't know, and again, if you haven't guessed for the title, I think this should be the PlayStation exclusive quest. Um, so it'd be quite a lot of fun. I don't know if you can tell from my voice, I am a little bit ill, so apologies for that, but I really wanted to make sure to get this quest out for you guys. Okay, we have also a chest right in the open, so let's do that, but... Pardon me? Hello, let's see, who are you? Penny. Let's see what Penny has to say. Hello there, was there something you needed? Hello, I was wondering if you would be interested in having your own shop and a house elf to help you with it. Penny's the name. Penny's mistress is selling this shop. And Penny is most eager to start working with the new owner. It might surprise you to know that Penny can sell practically anything. Mm, I am definitely intrigued. So I would say my shop and health would be brilliant. Oh, it would be wonderful to have a place to sell things and someone to help me. You'll be able to give Penny almost anything that you want to sell. It will be no work at all for you once the shop is up and running. If you want the shop and Penny hopes that you do, you should talk to Penny's mistress as soon as you can. Her name is Cassandra Mason. Why is your mistress selling the shop and you? Mm, Penny cannot be certain as Mistress Mason so rarely confides in her. Mm, however, she repeatedly mentions how tired she has become of trying to let the shop. She has had rotten bad luck with the last few tenants. <sighs> okay, definitely not a suspicious behavior. <laughs> All right. Are you holding your breath? <sighs> Penny's fine. Sometimes Penny simply needs to remind herself to stop talking. Okay. Um. Let's. I mean, I can probably sell normal stuff, but I want to know Why about the shop a bit more. Disarray. Oh, the previous tenants were not mm, able to manage very well. They seem to have given up rather quickly. <sighs> Okay. <laughs> Great. Uh, thanks, Penny. Perfectly capable of helping clean and repair, so the shop will be ready for business in no time. Why is the shop not ready for business in no time already? Then how is it you're so good at selling? Seems unusual for a house elf. Oh, before he died, Penny's previous owner, Master Mason, trusted her to do all sorts of things to help him with his shop. Penny supposes it is a bit unusual for a house elf to possess such skill, but Master Mason commanded it, and Penny was happy to oblige. Master Mason is a wonderful master. Hmm, okay. All right, I shall go and find Madam Mason. Oh, this is splendid news indeed. You won't be sorry. You can find Mistress Mason at her home on the north edge of the village. Penny does hope she gets to work with you. Okay, well, um, let's go and see Mrs. Mason's. I did see with the corner of my eyes these fireworks. Um, so let's enjoy some fireworks at the same time. Nice. Um, but it looks like Mr. Mason was a pretty good owner to Penny. And then Mrs. Mason, maybe it's a little less so. So we will see if this is the truth. Uh, Okay, I was worried I was going the wrong way for a second, uh, but um, I I really like the beginning already um, of this quest. So let's see what Mrs. Mason is, Cassandra Mason. Hello, Madam Mason. I understand you have a shop to sell. Yes, yes, I do. Are you interested? Um, yeah. let's go with I might be because you know we need to make sure that 
um, she doesn't give us a bad deal. So we need to just play a little bit uh, the game and try to not tell her that we were too interested. So I might be. Perhaps it depends upon your terms. Exactly. I think you will find my terms quite generous. But, and do please forgive me for asking, don't you think you might be a tad young to own a shop? Ageism. This is ageism. There you go. My age is irrelevant if I have the money. I am quite capable of owning a shop, I can assure you. I should think you'd be happy to have a buyer. Well, exactly. I reckon you have the confidence needed for such a venture. And of course you'll have Penny to help you. That elf could sell tea to a troll. I assume she told you she comes with the place. She did indeed. I like you. Tell you what. I shall sell you the space for an exceedingly fair price. I think you might just be shrewd enough to make a go of it. Hmm, an exceedingly fair price for a shop and an elf. What's the catch? Yeah. Huh? You are wise to be wary in business dealings. No catch, really. I simply ask that you allow me to do you the favor of buying the shop back. At a discount, of course. Should your efforts fail? Last thing we need here in Hogsmeade is for one bad apple to spoil the barrel, if you get my meaning. I'm not a bad apple. Um Okay, I'm I'm not entirely sure that I like her, so let's and we don't really choose the bad option often, so you know, let's go for it. Why would you assume that I'll fail? <laughs> your faith in me is overwhelming. You're sorely mistaken if you think I'm going to fail. There's that confidence again. And of course, I wish you every success. Do you though? Do have a deal? Um, okay. Well, you know, I want to know a bit more about it. What precisely do you mean, should my efforts fail? Honestly, I only mean that if for some reason you're unable to keep the shop going, I could help you cut your losses. That's all. But, mm. as you've implied, the odds of that happening are remote. I feel like she's setting up for failure, so the shop let's seems see. To be in an ideal location. Why has no one purchased it yet? It is indeed. But I've just decided to sell. I've grown weary of being a landlady. My late husband was the one with a passion for shopkeeping and business in general. You'd be wise to take advantage of this opportunity before the offers start rolling in. I don't see many offers, so... It looks to be rather a mess. Why haven't other tenants been able to make a go of it there? As you've no doubt considered, running a shop is not as simple as those less savvy might think. The new owner, however, will have something that previous tenants did not. The benefit of Penny's particular prowess. Her assistance will make all the difference, I should think, in both getting the shot ready for business and ensuring its success. Okay, well, I'll that have a think about intriguing, it. But I need to consider my finances first. I'll come and find you if I'm interested. Very well. But I won't be able to keep the shop available for too long. That's fine, but that's fine. The shop, I'd advise you to return to me as soon as possible. Hello again. And it just started snowing. Okay, so we need a thousand five hundred um, galleons to purchase the shop for Cassandra, and we have eight thousand nine hundred. So um, I'd say we have enough money. She was talking to herself, but anyways, let's speak with her again and buy the shop, I guess. Madam Mason, about the shop. Yes, I've decided I'd like to go ahead and purchase the shop. I have to say, I'm impressed. You are a remarkably resourceful student. I am Thank you. And brave. You won't be sorry. Give me the money and I shall get the paperwork filed immediately. Okay. Um, I mean, we want to buy it, so I will say this. Shall I head directly to the shop? Please do. Oh, one more thing. Since my husband died, I've not been able to bring myself to retrieve some of his personal items. Mm -hmm. They're in a chest at the back of the shop. Penny has the key. As 
if you get organized, I would be terribly grateful if you could help an old widow and gather his things for me before you open for business. I wish you the very best of luck in your endeavors. Penny will meet you there. I have a feeling that these belongings are not gonna... Um, actually, these belongings, we might have had a peek during the trailer, so... We'll see how it will go once we open the chest, I guess. But we have got the shop. Um, we have bought it right now. So, I mean, technically, we are already the shop owner. So, look at that. Easy as... Um, I don't know. Very easy. <laughs> easy peasy, lemon squeezy. There you go. That's what I say usually. Well, I've done it, Penny. The shop is mine. Oh! Penny is so pleased. Penny was hoping you would be the one to purchase it. I'm glad you're here to help me. Goodness, what a kind thing to say. Penny will do all that she can to make this a success. There is much to do. The last tenant left in a bit of a rush, so we'll need to clean up and do some repairs. Okay. Um, no time like the person. Well then, let's get to it. Penny is ready. Between the two of us, we should have this place up and running in no time. Okay. Well, I'm guessing I'm gonna need repair. And this is our shop, the first time we enter. Nice. Nice. Um, definitely a little bit worse for wear, but I'm sure that it'll get exactly like it needs to be in no time. I mean, you've seen this shop, like, in, in its prime, Penny, so... Perfect. Mistress Mason wanted Penny to be sure and give you this key. It opens a chest in the back room of this shop. Oh, yes. She mentioned it to me. It contains some of her late husband's belongings. Penny wonders if you should open the chest. <laughs> okay, she's still holding her breath. Holding your breath again? <sighs> Penny must get back to work now. Okay, hello Penny. Um, I mean, it is a bit concerning that she's still holding her breath because technically we purchased her when we purchased the shop. I wanted to have a quick look around the shop. It looks messy, um, but we have quote unquote repaired it. No vampires, or vampires, sorry. No trolls or vampires. Okay, well, let's see what's in this chest. I do like the word building solo, so I was looking a bit around. Um... Hmm. Okay, well, I'm sure this will go well. Not much music, I was kind of giving it a chance for the cutscene and just Staying quiet. Let's see where we end up. So the chest has closed and the stair is gone. Well, magic for sure. Okay, I am starting to be nervous. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, um, let's see. I mean, it's been agitating Hogwarts Legacy, but not scary. Although this is kind of tapping into that. So anything I'm missing right now? Okay, it doesn't look like there is much. There is a chest. Mm, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay, um, no, <laughs> I can tell you right now, I don't like that you're outlined, and there is another one over there, I don't like it, um, I'm going to do this, although I don't think it will help me much, but I'm frightened, are you going to move, oh, I don't like it, oh, I so don't like it, <gasps> there was another one over there, Oh, I don't like it. Okay, 
I guess I'm gonna be brave and search. Why did someone store one hat in here? Yeah, I don't know. Um, <gasps> I didn't even see that there was one next to me. Um, I guess I need to go back. I don't know. I don't like it. <clears throat> well, no. Very hospitable. No, exactly. <gasps> no. <laughs> Um, I don't For like it. Me, no. No. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't like it. Is there a door? Can I leave? Um. Mm, okay. Do I need to cast Lumos? I have a feeling I have to cast Lumos because nothing is happening. So I'm going to cast Lumos. Okay. Okay, this is not creepy at all. This is fine. Hello. Um. I don't know what I'm meant to do. I don't like it. Ow. That's new. Ooh. Onwards, I suppose. Okay. <gasps> what in the Whoops. I didn't mean to. I just wanted to stop casting Lumos. What's happening and behind and underneath and on the side? I don't like it. Okay, I'm fine. It's all good. Shit. It's just a game. We're good. I'm just fine. I don't like the fact that there are. Oh, I. That you don't like it. I just don't like it. You know. You know when you just don't like it. I don't know where I'm going. Um, I'm clearly supposed to be in here. <laughs> oh, okay. I was in the right place. I don't like it. Okay, feels really like layers of fear, everything is fine, that's something that I don't like. Oh, there was another the doll there, I, I just noticed that those are dolls. Okay, there was a doll there. No, where's the heartbeats? I don't know, I don't like it. I'm just gonna still be hidden because I do not like... Bats. Okay, Lovely. bats are fine, uh, it's fine. I had a nightmare with bats recently, but that's fine. I can deal with bats. Okay. Furniture flowing, but I mean, floating, I guess. Um, okay, there is like a light in there and there is no light. Oh, is it this? Hmm. Seems as if I should hang something there. Oh, is it? Is there another one on this side? Okay. Well, Akio, there we go, and then we put it here. I know I probably don't need to be hidden, but I just don't These like it. Must yeah, I'm trying to get it to the... There we go. Perfect. How enlightening. Thank you, Fastidio. You might survive a bit longer than the other. Funny um, thing, Fastidio means like somebody who's annoying in Italian. Um, okay. I would say more scary than annoying. Do I need. I feel like hiding won't do much. Okay, right now let's unhide. Just because we run a bit faster as well. Um, and then I'll, ah, uh, okay, <laughs> I'm not, I don't like it, <laughs> I don't like it, can I still go through the door, no, I can't, I don't like it, oh, I don't like it, where are we going, what's happening, I'm hidden, I hope nobody can see me, I can't see them, what's up, what's happening, okay, again, I feel like, whoops, Maybe I do need Lumos. I don't know. Yeah, I feel like I do need Lumos. Because every time I have Lumos, it then opens the door. Oh, okay. Oh, you've come so far, so quickly. Well done. You might be just the playmate I've been looking for. I do hope you enjoy my playground. I encourage you to tell everyone about it. If you make it out, that is. Please okay. Try. 
If you get to the end, perhaps we can come to some sort of arrangement. I do want your shop to succeed, after all. Do you now? What's the saying? Two sides to every storm. Is it gonna throw the furniture to me? Both sides here into my story. And you'll have to complete both to get okay. to the end. Okay, I, I was hiding because I was worried it was throwing them at me and it felt like it was. Um, okay, we're going here. Explore the library. No, that's not what I want. I hate, I know that I need, okay. Let's put um, this one here and then this one here for now because I don't like it. I. you've chosen the scholarly route, you'll need more than you've learned from books to best me. Okay, so there are two lanterns, I think, and I saw one, like, over there. Okay. How, where do we find the other lanterns? I don't know, let's explore. Okay, there is a fun corridor, okay. Oh, okay. Okay, this is fun because I, I just I'm, I'm fine. Everything's all right, you know. Like that's fine. It's it was just it's turning around. Okay, there is a door coming out there, so I have a feeling that. Revelia. Is there anything I can grab? No, I don't know if I really want to jump. Like, down? Is that the thing? No. Um, do I jump down? No, I don't. Okay. Well, this was a fun adventure. Oh. Okay, I see what's happened. It's changed. I see. I see. How naive of me. How naive indeed. I'm just gonna go up the stairs, I guess. And the door doesn't open. Okay. What do I do? Where do I go? Lumos. Let's do Lumos again. Just in case. Um, I'm not sure what I'm doing. The door didn't open. So... Um... What do I do? Do I go back? Is there a lantern that I didn't see? Do I go back out there? Okay, the door there is open. But how do I get there? Um... Hmm... Okay, I'm stumped. Okay, let's put the Lumos away for now. And let's see. I'm sure there's something that we need to do here. What that something is, I don't know. Can we, like, grab anything? Is there anything, like, lighting up? I know that there is something over there, but I just don't understand how do I get there. You know? Like, can I grab? Oh, I can grab it from here. I see. Okay, so come with me, lantern. Go first. And then we'll put you here. Somehow. There we go. Okay, so now... We can go down. Do we take the lantern? Um, let's see. Maybe not. I feel like if I take the lantern, I can probably take the lantern from... Whoops. I was going to say from somewhere else, but I don't know. Um, from here? Does this bring me... 
back in where where am I? Okay, so I'll go back and take the lantern. I'm sorry, I'm thinking. Okay, I can go back and take the lantern. I see. Also, is that a tapestry? What's happening there? Yes. Okay, so I can go back and take the lantern. Noted. Fine. Um, I'll just go forward and... Oh, take this lantern. This is all good. It's fine. We're, you know, just by ourselves. There's no one else here. And nobody's trying to hurt us. So we're good. One might say we're Gucci. Lumos. We're gonna say Lumos again. Perhaps I should pull the lantern into this room to cause the room to rotate again. Okay, one like give me a second to think about it, but sure. Where do I put it? Because I feel like I'm gonna bring it with me and I'm gonna put it somewhere else. There it is. Okay, well. Thank you. So Okay, so we have one of them. And we need to bring it here. Okay, so we did one and I'm guessing we're gonna go to the other side and do the other one. And everything is gonna go well. That one was fine. There is a table. It's a nice dungeon. It's scary, I was saying. No, thank you. Um, do I go forward, I guess? Mm, I didn't like that, you know? I didn't like that at all. I actually hated it. Um, this looks like the beginning. Am I back at the beginning? Okay, no, no, just seeing the outline, I, mm, no, 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 do I need to go in the other one? Oh, I don't like it, I don't like it, I so don't like it, <sighs> okay. We're fine. Everything is fine. We're brave. We're brave. We're brave. We're brave. We're brave. We're so brave. You know, you and me. You and me. N ah. No. Okay, so now I have to deal with all the chairs. Just press through all the chairs. Are you gonna attack me? I don't like that. Chair. Stay away. It's a weird effect also with the magic right now. I have a feeling. Anything that it's highlighted, I'm gonna... There you go. You can't hurt me if I... Like, destroy everything that you're about to throw at me. Are we going in circles? I have a feeling we're going in circles. I'm gonna go a little bit longer, but then I'm gonna go back. Okay, we're definitely going in circles now, so now I go back, right? And it's gonna be changed, yes! Look at me, smart, 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 smart. Oh, I'm smart and brave, I'm smart and brave, everything is good. I don't like it. Lumos. Okay, it's a little bit better, the magic is really weird. I feel like we're having some visual glitches, but it's fine. Ah, I, what was that? I don't like it. How are you so calm? Excuse me. Mm, no, whatever this is. <gasps> no, although our face is also very creepy right now, I'll be honest. Um... No, just no. Can no? Okay, we need to go back. I didn't like it. I'm fine. It's all good. We're good. I know you probably you're like this is not scary at all. This is scary for playing it. Oh, okay. Is there a door right now? 
Is there a door right now? Where is the door right now? Put me out of this misery. Where do I go? I can't go in there. I can't go in here. There is no door anywhere. Hello, give me a door. Where is the door? Where is the door? Well, I'm, okay, I'm guessing I'm gonna... There we go, okay. <gasps> no! No! I don't like it. Is there more? There is so much more. There is many more. Okay, I'm just gonna... I can't move. Okay, so we're doing Lumos. Ha 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 ha! So funny! Ha! Funny joke! <laughs> I don't like it! <laughs> okay, we're fine. Oh my god, I hate it. Um... Um, mm, I don't like it. Lumos. I wanted to just make sure that the furniture didn't come to me. Lumos. So, <sighs> okay. So there is a door over there. I'm just gonna go for the door. Thank you so much, uh, best friend. Okay, I am fine. There is a little puppet over there. And there is another door over here. There is three doors. I don't know. I don't really want to go say hi to the puppet, I'll be honest. Like, I see the puppet over there. I don't see any um, reason for me to check the puppet. I'm just gonna say no and go out. And there is no door here. Okay, so I'm gonna check the other one. Before saying hi to the puppet, because I feel like we're gonna have to say hi to the puppet. Okay, hi puppet. I, um, no. Why am I interacting? Oh, the shadow there, though. It's quite cool. Let me see if I can get the shadow of the puppet. Yeah, that's quite cool. Um, excuse me, why would you interact with it? Oh, I need to hold it. No. I've done it enough. You know? Okay, I guess I need to. <sighs> I don't like it. Mm. No. Okay. Question is, what happens if I... <gasps> okay, wait a second. Incendio was a really good one. I like that. Um... Okay, well, I have a new favorite spell, and it's Incendio, and I'm gonna press it on everybody, because I am not dealing with any one of you, so... Okay, do, do you like my strategy? I'm feeling actually a lot calmer now. <gasps> no, no, Lumos. No, 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 What's happening? Excuse me? No, 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 How do you know I'm here? Okay, how do you know I'm here? I would not. Okay, I can... Three hits, it's fine. Whoops, I am in a corner. Okay. Um, I don't like it. Okay. Incendio can do it. Okay. Okay, one on the other ones and then... No, no, not this one. Incendio. How am I not incendiating you? Um... <gasps> okay, whoops, I didn't see you there. I... I am... Okay. Protego, I... I need to... Why can I not hit you? Okay, you were the most annoying one. Okay, one second. I would like you to go away. Okay. I see you. Why are you not destroying? Okay. Who is there? I. Okay. Is it gonna keep going forever? Okay, mm, apparently not. Where am I? I heard a door. Um. Thank you. OK, 
Okay. Uh, why aren't you dying? I would like you to just disappear. Okay, that is something. Oh my god, okay. Um, I guess we'll go and see what this is. Okay, this is just a painting. I don't know, dude. What, what's up? What's good? You know? Um, I am gonna try and keep an eye on you and miss the door. Okay. Okay. We're good. You know, this is just... Oh, sweet. Okay, I didn't like that, you know. I am hoping that this is gonna end quickly. I have a feeling it's not. Um, this was it, right? Um, okay. You can tell that I don't play many horror games. Um, okay. I'm fine. What's good, you know, fastidio. Oh, this is definitely not a boss battle, you know, like why would a boss battle be here? I don't know, but anyways, I feel like I won't need Akio or to, uh, I'm gonna craft my own little, um, you know, spell a uh, bit here. Um, I feel like Lumos might be still helpful and then um, Glacius will be good, but also just one second you know just let's check which one we have upgraded because i don't remember have we got anything upgraded come fringo um okay um i feel like like we don't have any talent points okay that's fine that's great um that's gucci yay i don't think like the dark arts are gonna do anything with them so let's go with this um can i already destroy the barrels Okay, I can't. I can. Okay, I have. Is it? I am not enjoying myself. Okay, there is a lot more battles. What's happening? I don't like it. Okay, I'm... I should probably look at him. Yeah, uh, looking at him seems to be the strategy. Run, run, run. Oh, there is a line, there is a line, there is a line. I need to be away from the line. I need to be away from the line. I need to be away from the line. Okay. I'm going to the line. Okay, we're good. Okay, you just lapped me. You just lapped me. What's happening? Is it done? <laughs> you just... He just came and slapped me and that was basically it. Okay. Um. Um, okay. I see. I see. I was running into the wall. That's fine. Okay. He just wanted to slap me. That, we could have ended it a lot quicker. I feel like I would have just rather taken the slap and that's it, you know. Um, because I feel like this was a bit unnecessary. Uh, but, I mean, that's my opinion. Everybody's entitled to their opinion. Um, okay. I'm not trusting... Okay. Uh, I was gonna say any furniture. But I can't really um, destroy a sofa, apparently. Spiders. Yay. And so much. So pretty. Like most living things, will survive. I have an idea. Look at that. Yeah, I wasn't listening. I'm sorry to say. <laughs> I was just thinking, oh, but I can burn everything down. So, um, I don't know what you were saying. Yes, I know. I was just having a second of fun. You know, condemn me for it. I was just trying to destroy all of these... Um, all of these spider webs, they're still going. Look at that. It's a very cool chain reaction. Nice, nice. Um, oh, look at that. There is a chest. A leather flat cap. Nice. Is there? I feel like there were other. I just passed through some. Okay. No. No. I'm just. 
Okay, I'm gonna confing all of you guys. You know? This is just a very good spell. So, bye bye everybody. Um, no thank you. Um, I- oh, I like the harp, like, actually. Like, suede. Um. Rebellion. Anybody else? No. Oh, yes. Just one more for good measure. Yeah. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just yes. Um. All good. Um. I do not really like this. Can I? I have a feeling that all of these are gonna get thrown at me. So I would like to um, say no thank you. And just... Um... Whoops, I forgot that I... I forgot I need Accio. Um, okay, Vasily, I feel like you have been the least scary thing. I've been more scared of the mannequins, I'll be honest. Um, oh, there is something over there. Okay, we jumped there before with no issues, but now we're scared. Look at this. There's something here. Wow, 57. <gasps> no, thank you. No, thank you. Just no, thank you. Okay, where are we going? Oh, straight on. Straight on. Okay, okay. I see it. I don't want to be thrown chairs. Uh, thank you very much. So I am going to destroy them. Hmm, I'd offer you a seat, but I'm rearranging the furniture. Faster, aren't you getting too comfortable for what's in store? Do I? Okay, well... You are annoying, you stand, stand up for your name. So, good for you, buddy. Um, okay, so that one, I'm guessing here. And then something else will happen somewhere. I don't know where, but I'm sure that it's... No, I see it, I see it, I see it. I saw, I saw, I saw the chat. I saw it and I was trying to... Okay. Mm. I don't like that. Okay. So I'm gonna... I'm suggesting I'm gonna take... Whoops. I meant Akio. Perfect. Look at that. I don't even have to jump. Oh, but now it's... Mm. Okay. So I'm guessing I need to... Go back and grab the other one and put it on there. Oh, that's why the chair reappeared. Can I grab it from here? Let's see. Yes, I can. And then I can drop it there and go back. Okay. Not too difficult, not too difficult. Thank you, thank you. I'm sure I'll just be able to go through. Well mm. No! Incendio. They're too far for Incendio. I wanted to... Okay. Okay, we're good. Incendio. Too far. Okay, Glacius is nice. I like Glacius. I'm kind of trying to get my... Back to the wall! Okay, but... um, What's that? Oh, the ancient magic. I see. Okay. Okay, I kind of like being against or something. Okay, ha 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 ha. So funny, funny joke. Ah, uh, okay. I go with the door. I'm sure that nothing is happening behind me. Okay, I'll go back. Do I need to keep going? I don't know, maybe I do need to just keep going. Let's see. Ah ha ha ha. 
And Lumos is back. Lumos. Okay. There is. Lumos. Okay. There is. Oh, there is something actually. Oh, and there are my not favorite. Is there something behind me? No. Okay. Okay, okay. Chest. Lumos. A uniform. Look at that. He stole a uniform from... This wasn't how it was, was it? Maybe I was supposed to go there. The lantern was freaking out. Oh, wait. Maybe... Did I complete it? Whoops. I keep forgetting that I've changed my spells and then think that there is... Akio is still there, but there isn't. Whoops, I let go. Okay, I'm just a little bit frazzled, honestly, with all of this. Because it's scary for me. I'm sure that people not find it scary, but I do. Is there something? I don't know. Okay, this seems too easy. But, but thank you. I couldn't even get there in time to see it. I'm guessing we put it here and then something happens. Oh yeah, because we can't go out anymore and then and then we need to put it over there. Mm. Oh, look at the funny bike. Nice. I I'm I'm like I uh, I was going to say I just don't want to keep going forward, you know. I'm just a little bit like done. I just I want a little bit of a breather. Whoa, okay. Wait a second. This is so cool. I am taking everything back. I'm enjoying I mean I'm enjoying it, but also a game within a game. Ooh. Ooh. Night to H3. Yes! Nice reference. Night night. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Oh I love it. I mean, I, I can see what's happening, kind of. Oh, there is a chest as well. Okay. But, wow. I just want to see all of them, like, up close. But I am scared also. <laughs> so I'm going to go here. Can I walk off the board? I don't think so. Okay. Will it kill me if I go, like, right next to it? I don't know, but... Oh, it looks so cool. I'm just really, like... Enjoying it, trying to find, like, a good spot. Look at this. Oh, what a nice, like... Screenshot, you know? Nice, okay. Okay... Don't mind me, little... Um... Where do I go from here? Okay, I can go there, I can go there, I can go there. Do I just jump? Whoops, okay, I did it. Um, and then... I made it? That wasn't I... too difficult. Look at that. Nice. Imagine I just go on the last one. Oh goodness! <laughs> I do hope you're having as much fun as me. To be fair, that was really cool. For studio, I will give you that. Sorry, I was trying to clean up the space. Oh, more always, more ominous always. Oh, did we do it? Did we do it? I would love if we did it. There we go. Oh. I see. Can we take it back? Whoops. Maybe, maybe not. Well, maybe we don't need it. Is it done? Yes. Oh, I like that one. That one I liked. Oh, the other way. Whoopsie. But I like that one. It was really cool to see, actually, the, the chessboard. That's actually really, really cool. 
a nice reference, although this happened way in the past, so technically McGonagall stole the idea from Fastidio, I guess. Um, the, ooh, I was about to miss on two health potions. How could have I, you know? And I didn't, so that's good. Well, we now have... Okay, boss, boss battle. Are you going to slap me again? Um, who will Bombarda? Bombarda will be good. Let's put Bombarda here. Okay. What have you got for studio? Not. I'll go with not. And uh, nowhere. Did I do it? Are you coming to stop me? Oh, okay. No, no, Confringo. We were Confringoing them. Remember? Go, 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 go. Kill the furniture. Clean the furniture. Okay, I was trying to. Okay, I can't. It's just a slap. Okay, every time you just slap me and that's it. I mean, I did fight a couple of people there, but it just feels like you just want to slap me. I don't, I don't get it, Fastidio. I, you know, I like the dungeon. The boss battle feel like it's just a slap. I mean, I don't want a more difficult one at the same time, so I won't complain too much. I'm just, it's just funny to me. Like, okay. is there nothing in here? Just making sure, yeah, there is something up here. Um, over here. Five health potions, okay. Anything else? Nope. Um, okay, this looks inviting. I like what you've done with the place. Um, mm, there I can see through. There is a little hole, a little peekaboo. Okay. Are we... Is this the final boss battle? Let's see. I like the... I like the, the setting. Just... Uh, just very cool. Perfect for Halloween. Uh, actually, let's reveal you. Is there anything hiding? Ah, okay. Whew. We can do this. Inordinately clever friend appeared to have traversed this seemingly never-ending dungeon relatively unscathed. And now I suppose you want to go. Everyone leaves me, usually in a straitjacket, never to return. I'm starting to take it personally. I'm tired of having no one to play with. Ooh. Ooh. Tell you what, I'll make you a deal. If you can match wits with me now, and do you agree to give me unfettered access through the shop for, say, one day a month to have a little fun, I'll sign a contract. Pursue it to which, um, uh, let me see, I will blah, 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 blah. Oh, yes, I'll leave you and your customers alone at all other times, etc., etc. You get your shop, I get my chaos. Sound acceptable? Excellent! <laughs> Let the games begin! Okay, we're back, we're back. Nothing happened. We just, what do we do? Okay. I can just run. That's good. Okay, that was step one, I guess. Um, is it um? Okay, that looks like a monster. Oh. Okay, you know what? I have this. So goodbye. Is it completely done? I feel like it was stages, so I don't know. Is it back? Okay, did that destroy completely the stage? That was pretty good. Ooh, I don't like the fact that there are everybody else as well. I mean... There we go. Any more for any more? Ooh, hello. 
What's happening? Are you... Oh, no. I don't like this, but I have this one. So I'm just going to press um, end on it. Okay. Well, well. Finally, someone deserving of the playground I so meticulously crafted. I guess I did it. <laughs> I feel a little bit bad. I... Um, I, I feel like, okay, well, whatever, I guess we did it. Um, I must say, I enjoy a good challenge. Ah, a kindred, dare I say, spirit. So, about that contract. I am a poltergeist of my word. Okay, um, what are the terms? Just to be clear, what does this agreement entail, specifically? Ugh, pay attention. You guarantee that I can have my fun at least one day each month without fuss. I let you work the rest of the time, mostly, in peace. Why would you enter into such an agreement? Much as I love banging about the place, it's no comparison to seeing customers' faces when I bonk them on the heads with a chocolate frog. That's... One doesn't really understand the value of an audience until one is without. Yeah, I don't really want you to bonk my customers with chocolate frogs. Very well. I shall agree to your contract. With one small addendum. Hooray! No more of this unsatisfying banging about all day in a pitiful void. Wait, did you say one small addendum? I did. In order that I have a successful shop with lots of customers, would you agree to causing chaos only after nine o'clock in the evening? Hmm. Hmm. Would you agree to at least two days a month instead of one? I would. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay, so we just closed the shop Walk before. Oh, well done. I have a feeling about you. Okay. I have to admit, Cassandra did a wonderful job finding the perfect playmate. Thank you. Are you going to do anything else? No, you're just going to stand here. I kind of want to have your face on the full screen. Hello, Fastidio. I don't know where you're looking, but thank you for the battle that I feel very bad about because I feel like I could have... Um, I don't know. I, I didn't expect it to kind of end after three shots of the ultimate thing, considering, you know, I have already three full ones. Um, so I don't know. Anyways, it was still fun. I got really scared during the dungeon, though. Um, uh, let me light this torches. Do they light up? No. Okay, well, I wanted to give you some light. <sighs> I guess goodbye, Fastidio. We will see you twice a month. Um at some point um so let's see what penny has to say because uh, i have a feeling she was in cahoots with fastidio all this time so hello penny hello penny oh, penny is so glad you're back um okay let's I do feel like she's probably just following orders, so let's be nicer to Penny and less nice to Cassandra, because I have a feeling we're going to speak to her again. Were you worried I might not return? Penny was beginning to think yet another shopkeeper was going to end up in St. Mungo's. Another shopkeeper? St. Mungo's? I think you should explain, Penny. <sighs> Penny, please stop holding your breath. Tell me what's going on. <sighs> oh, please... Forgive Penny. Penny is forbidden from telling you anything. But I own you, quote unquote, no? How can you be forbidden exactly. from telling me what's going on? I purchased the shop. I... Penny is confused. Penny thought that if you came back, you would own the shop. Yeah. Okay, well, you told me Thank what you, you could. Penny. I think I'm going to need to talk to the authorities. Oh, Penny is certain that's a brilliant <laughs> idea. Officer Singer will know what to do. Penny will wait right here. I mean, Officer Singer hasn't known what to do about almost anything. So I have my doubts, I'll be honest. But let's see what Officer Singer has to say. Let's see what she can help us with. Because again, I have a feeling she's not really going to be able to help us with much. Officer 
Dr. Singer, I have some information you might be interested in. Ah, good to see you again. What can I do for you? Cassandra Mason sold me her shop and then tried to drive me mad in a haunted dungeon. I... Cassandra Mason sold you her shop. Yeah, why are you surprised? I am perfectly capable of owning a shop. But more importantly, did you not hear the bit about the dungeon? No, no, I, I heard that bit too. And according to the house elf that came with the shop, she's done this sort of thing before, repeatedly. Hmm. I wondered what was going on. She seems to have had a great deal of trouble keeping a tenant in that shop. In any event, these are serious accusations indeed. Yes. Perhaps a little visit with Cassandra is in order to clear this all up. Shall we? Yes, we shall. Okay. Are you running? Am I running first? I don't know. I thought she said only a Harry Potter sort will cast Philip and Donna Cow. That's what I heard. Sorry, I, the people speaking always just confuse me so much. Let's see what Cassandra has to say for us, huh? Oh, hello, Ruth. I see you've met my new tenant. Cassandra, it's my understanding that you sold your shop and your elf to this student. Now they've been telling me some very interesting stories about your business practices. Perhaps you should come with me. Uh, uh, okay, well that escalated quickly. Uh, stop her. Uh, you don't really do much, officer singer. Eh? I did press. Oh, we did the same spell. Look at us, Cassandra. Maybe we're more friends than... Ooh, hello. I was trying to run and that didn't work. I need to heal. I'm trying to heal. I should have known better than to do business with a wise student. Why am I not healing? Oh, it's the bottom one. Whoopsie. Okay, that was my bad. Wait. How do I... Okay, I need to cast stuff if I have a feeling. Okay, I can't cast stupefy there, I can't cast stupefy there, and I can here. There you go. What on earth are they teaching you at that school these days? Nothing much, but I'm definitely um Oh hello. Can I there we go. Okay, I guess we need we do Where are you? Okay, did we do it? Imagine I just casted a Vada Kedavra immediately. I'm disappointed in you, Cassandra. Incarcerate! You don't know what you're doing! <sighs> don't I? I always wondered why you couldn't seem to keep a tenant in that shop of yours. I must admit, the notion of a haunted dungeon never crossed my mind. Thanks for this. You can head back to the shop. Second that house elf of yours, she's probably terrified. Silencio. Okay. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent, Silencio. <laughs> and not to worry. Cassandra will immediately file the paperwork needed to grant you ownership of both the shop and the elf. On her way to Azkaban. Thank you, Officer Singer. Best of luck to you as the newest shop owner in Hogsmeade. I mean, I is there no other prison other than Azkaban? Um, I see a chest, sorry, in the meantime. Because I do, I mean, I do think she should pay for what she's done. But also, I don't know, is there no other, um, like, uh, no other <laughs> place that they send bad wizards other than Azkaban? Because, I don't know, is she the same as having, well, I guess she did, I don't know. It's, uh, I don't know. I don't know if she should pay too, so much, I feel like. We're live, but I guess other people did go to some mangoes, so... I don't know, would you send her to Azkaban? Would you just send her to a normal prison? Um, let me know in the comments, I would like to know. I also would like to know what you thought about the quest. I know it's not, yeah, finished, but it's basically there. Um, I really liked it. Um, I do think that I could have kept the battle going a little bit more, but I didn't expect that to be the only thing. I thought we were going to fight um, him as well. 
uh, fastidio. But anyways, let's see what Penny, Penny says. I have it looks creepy. Be good news. Officer Singer confirmed that ownership of the shop has now transferred to me. Oh, well, that is good news. Penny is so relieved. Penny had the most difficult time keeping the truth from you. Penny promises to work as hard as she can for such a kind new owner. Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh, what do we do? Um. I mean, we do have Deke that helps us already. Do we want to free her or not? Oh. Let's free her. I'm sure she will stay in the shop. I have a feeling she will stay in the shop and nothing will change. But um, but why not? We are good. We are brave Gryffindors. We can free her. Penny, I found an item of clothing in the dungeon that I'd like to give you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Penny never thought she would be given clothing and become a free elf. It's my pleasure. You deserve it. Of course, Penny will be staying <laughs> there you go. managing the shop for you. Of course. Penny, you're free. You can do anything you've ever wanted to. But all Penny has ever wanted to do is run a shop with a friend and sell to the villagers in Hogsmeade. If that's what you want to do, Penny, then nothing would make me happier. I'm genuinely glad you'll be staying on. Penny is too. All that's left is for you to choose a sign for your new shop and Penny will take Ooh. care of the rest. What do we choose? Vesters and Venom. I do like that. Clodwell and Brewster. Stitches and Draughts. Mm, I like Venom. So I'd say Vesters and Venom. Uh, my second choice would be Stitches and Draughts. And then Clodwell and Brewsters. Um, let's go with this one. I choose Vesters and Venom. Excellent choice. Have a look outside. Thank you. I shall work on collecting items for the shop's inventory. Yeah, let's oh, see what we can sell. Penny, we'll be closing the shop by nine o'clock every night. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there it is with the hat. We got a shopkeeper's coat, a shopkeeper's top hat, and shopkeeper's ensemble. Let's see. Let's speak with Penny. Uh, I am waiting for her to get there. Oh, no, we need to be closer. I thought she was going to be behind the counter. Something you'd like Penny to sell for you? For you? Yes, we do. Okay, let's sell oh, this. Penny will fetch a good price for what you'd like to sell. So it's ten percent more, I think. Like we're getting nine galleons over what we'd be selling this for normally. Um. Okay, this is still less than. Sorry, I thought for a second that it was like better. Not that we need the money right now, I'll be honest. But anyways. Penny wishes you safe and wondrous travels. Thank you, Penny. Okay, let's go see the sign outside then. We have our shop. Vesters and Venom. Let's see. Oh, look at that. Our beautiful shop. Well, with this, I think... It's a great place to end the episode. Look at that. We got our shop. We completed the dungeon with Metfa Studio. And we managed to send Cassandra into Azkaban. So I'd say a very fruitful episode. Um, I hope you have enjoyed it. I was really excited to play this. And I've been waiting to time it. So that it would come out just before Halloween. I did do um, um, the... I was going to say Azkaban, but that's not it. The word Avada Kedavra, there you go. Avada Kedavra quest um, as well last week. And that was, again, timed perfectly for Halloween. I like the owl on the Zonko sign. Um, so, yeah, I'm very excited, honestly. I've been waiting. Sorry, I was just trying to walk cinematically as I speak. Um, I don't know. I'm really, really happy that we've done this quest. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, as I said, again, I've just been waiting so long to do it i was just hoping to time it perfectly and i kind of did so yeah thank you for checking it out i really appreciate it if you are not subscribed please subscribe so you can see the rest of my adventures in hogwarts legacy um and yeah also let me know if you 
you know, what game you would like me to play next, because I think we're kind of reaching the end. Um, I do want to do still more stuff here in Hogwarts Legacy. Um, but yeah, I don't know how much more there would be um, content-wise. So just just to be interesting to know your what you next want to see. But yeah, thank you so much again. Um, and yeah, if you have enjoyed the video, please leave me a like. Let me know what you want to see next in the comments below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!